Hey, Steve Zook, welcome back to Guitar Ladder. I'm going to do this one again because, uh, you know, it was a little hard for some people to see this chord. I have other versions of it, but it has lots of, you know, promo stuff on YouTube, so I thought I'd do it again. So here, here's the cycle. Maybe when you're done with this cycle, you know, at the end, see where else you can take it. That's the whole idea behind the guitar letter system is see where you can go, you know, improvise. And, and, and even if it doesn't sound that great, just, you know, push your brain a little bit, you know, push your musical mind, see where you can take it. So one more time. So we have this. This is I'm just messing around. But the basic idea, you know, partials are so important, and th this cycle has a real nice way that it has smooth voice leading and small little interval skips. It creates movement, it creates direction, and it resolves down to the 13 chord. So it's I'm really proud of this one. Like I said in my other video, I, I discussed this one with Ted Green. He loved this little cycle. We talked about it for 20 minutes. So. Okay. Joe Pass would like this one too. So don't let the fact that it's short diminish it. You know, it's a good one. And then, like I said, when you get to the end, maybe improvise. Good thing to do on this one would be to try, to try starting this here and then alter a couple tones and just see how, see how much of this you can duplicate starting on a different set of strings. Even if you just get two or three chords, it would really be good to do. Okay, so one more time. That has a nice way that it connects. It's almost like, you know, you know, words in a sentence that connect nicely, you know what I mean? Or colors in a painting that, that complement each other. And it kind of resolves. Alright. This is available by the way, $4.99. It's a really sweet guitar. The Lore LH280. Take care.